Hey, 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 hey! Oh my goodness! <laughs> oh, you gonna have babies finally? Um, I found this uh, town and I took it over. I made it mine. Um, I changed this uh, this one up a little bit. Put the door around here, but most importantly, <laughs> do you see what I see? Do you see what I see? Oh my god! Alright, so. Yeah. <laughs> my storage has gotten a major overhaul. Um. Yeah. So what that one's gonna be is all blocks. And here's my forge. And uh, this is gonna have like, um, I don't know, coal and lava and stuff. And I put a button on it because I don't want the little villagers coming in and out. I do, when I put on my mom's spawner, I, I close them in their, their little houses and they're not happy. Because I lost a whole lot of them. They're down to like three now. <laughs> what are you doing? Have baby. Anyway, I made them that house. Oh my god, corners. 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 I made them that house and... Um, did I, no, I didn't make, I made this one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, look at it. Look at it. Just look at it. Um, oh, yeah, the fences. <laughs> um, well, uh, thing to note if you don't know about it already, but if you make a mossy stone fence and you, uh, take it up with your pick, it's going to turn into cobblestone. So, be careful of that. Anyway, I took up all my farms. All this was farmland here a little while ago. And I took them all up, um, and then I had to lay one of them down again because I finally got a carrot. It took me forever. The potato came quick. Um, I killed like 20 zombies, and I finally got a potato. But the carrot, oh my god, I have two mob spawners, and still couldn't get a carrot. Um, I leveled this land. This land used to be that high. See how high that was? It was that high over here, and I took some TNT to it. But I also have, uh, you know, I got my my um, my picks and then my fabulous shovels, which tear the hell out of the land. Um, cause I was gonna use TNT on sand, but oh wait a minute, that's not the one. Efficiency four. Oh yeah, watch it, watch it, don't blink. <laughs> yeah, only problem is I have, you know, not. I have a little bit of control with it. I gotta be careful because then it'll make big gouging holes. Um, anyway, let me uh, let me show you the reason why I came in here because I saw that um, people are uh, obviously changing their uh, their storage rooms and they're putting the frames up. But I want to give you a little a little peek into what my um, my garden um, storage room looks like now. And this, of course, is going to be uh, the garden one. Right here. You see my little flower. And um, I got to I gotta make a kitchen. Or bakery. Put all that crap in it. But, yeah. Here's the garden. Now, you can just put boxes in here. And put your frames. But, I think that has personality. And I started doing this on my Fallon world, I think it was. And what I did was, um, each each layer of storage had a theme. So if I went down to the next one, which was stone, I had all the different kind of stones like I have in the other storage room. And then I go down again, and I have all the sand. So I had a cactus in there. It was like it was like an oasis. And then I had the Nether, and I actually had my Nether portal in it. And then I had fire and Nether rack, so it actually looked like you were in the Nether. Um, and I'm going to be doing that here too. Um, this one is going to mainly be um, garden and then just dirt storage, I think, down below. I don't think I'm going to go very far uh, downstairs with this one. Um, and also, you can't really go that far. Um, you can, you know, if I'm doing a room that's, uh, I think, 7 by 9 by uh, 6. Because I do the floor and the ceiling, then 
you only get so many levels down that you can work with so that's going to help enormously like putting the tools in there putting everything redstone-ish in here and and then putting all the blocks in here and probably this will be the bakery maybe I I, I might change it I wasn't I wasn't happy with it I was going to make this the wood but I took my tree my tree farm used to be here this long thing was my tree farm and I'm taking all the stairs up I liked them in the beginning but yeah they look a little funky I'm leaving these I guess but um I was the, the villagers aren't having babies and I'm thinking that it's probably because I took up the, the gravel maybe I don't know but they're not populating the town and I even made them a little guardian he's roaming over there and they got like tons of houses so they should be you know making making babies like bunnies but they're not hello whoop there you go okay oh my god I'm getting swarmed what what he's like don't leave my damn door open lady what the hell is the matter with you okay all right excuse you sheesh where are you going in such a damn rush you got a hot date you idiot oh man and the zombies uh, even in my spawner let me show you my spawner real quick um this is how I finally got the the carrot because I sure as hell wasn't going to get it off of uh my mob grinder I don't know my mob grinder is all screwed up the mobs are uh, spawning outside and falling down there it is up there um but I saw this hole in here and I decided to investigate and I came around the corner and there was mossy so but there we go so I got them in here and they uh turn it on normal come on He's spinning, he's spinning. Hup. And he goes there. And that water takes them and pushes them down this little alleyway right here. Which has more water that pushes them into this hole that goes 22 blocks below. So they take damage. And then I go down. Ooh, I'm going to spider. Hopefully nothing will spawn up on top and kill my damn villagers. Because <laughs> I only got a couple left. And then you come down here, you flip the switch, you wait for all the junk to... What? Hello? What happened to the water? Oh, there it is. So you wait for all the whatever might have fell, and then you... Oh, what happened? Oh, the water was on, and they didn't take damage. Oops. Oh, well, whatever. Yeah, make sure you turn the water. It's controlled by pistons. The sticky piston and it pushes it in and out and then the the redstone is behind this wall and that's pretty much it so um the seed is creeper with a capital c and um i'm waiting till they update the minecraft um engine to 1.4 and then i'm gonna uh then i'm gonna bring my sky world in here and i also have another one uh with the seed fallon and I've been playing that one. It's been fun. But I wanted to give you guys a little quickie. And, well, <laughs> a little look, a quick look at how, how the, what I'm doing. And also how ecstatic I am with the new um, corners, picture frames, and pots. Oh my god, I'm going overboard with the pots. <laughs> There's pots everywhere! But... Anyway, so, yep, I'm going to go into my little house here. Look at that. You don't even have to guess. Like, I watch this now, and he's constantly looking in that box, looking in that box, looking over here to see where he put shit. Now, granted, people who are already messy with their chests are going to still be messy. You know, they'll have something on the chest, and then it'll be filled with other crap. Um, anyhow. So, it's not going to solve everybody's problem, but... It did mine. Oh my god, it revolutionized my um my storage. Then I got my little enchanting table down here. Oh yeah. And I found a stronghold, so I used my silk touch pick on um on the books. And I have a chanting table up there and I have one down here. Hey, what's up? Hello. Hello. Say bye.
Say hi, YouTube. Bye, YouTube. Yeah, he's not impressed. Yeah, okay. Bye.